Hey guys, welcome back to more Let's Play Persona 3 FES The Answer. Uh, last time we took down Junpei and Koromaru, and oh my god, I felt horrible for doing that to Koromaru. I'm so sorry. He's the goodest boy. But, <sighs> didn't really have a choice. Only one pair of our teammates re remain. Yukari and Mitsuru. So... That's... I just want to change my equipment background because I no longer need the Ring of Darkness. I'm pretty certain the Wizard's Mark is the one I want to go with. Yeah, that's gonna be the best I can. That's gonna be the best I have. Yeah, I uh, don't enjoy having to do this, but what other option is there? Mitsuru and Yukari are all that's left. Let's just get it over with, I suppose. I guess. It's strange. I kind of want to say, long time no see to you guys. When was the last time we saw Yukari actually smile? For a cutscene, not just g giving her a good piece of gear. It's been a little bit. You know, I had a feeling a while back that something like this might happen. There are four lit flames. This battle will determine which side gains the true key. Well, have you made your choice? Tell me that you didn't defeat the others without a clear objective. Yes. I've made my decision. I know what I want to do. There was something crucial that I hadn't known. But my sister revealed it to me. To care about someone dear to you. To strengthen the bonds of friendship. That doesn't necessarily mean that the pain of living will stop. Sister. If something's precious, you don't want to lose it. If someone's dear, it's painful to part with them. Loss can hurt, but I don't think there's anything wrong with that. I, too, have something important. That's why I'm willing to fight you two now. I guess. <laughs> you sound like you're back to your usual self again. You know, I have to say, you've been a little out of it lately. It was kind of disappointing, because you were acting all mechanical, like when you first got to the dorm. But now, I'd say you've got more life in you than ever. Yukari-san. All the same, I can't give in either. I'm not going to lose this battle, no matter what. Alright, so... In my opinion, Mitsuru is the greater threat because she has charm. Get ready, cause I'm gonna tear you apart. Cause she can inflict charm, so I'm going to. Show me your resolve. So I'm going to assign Metis. This is the last battle. If we win. Understood. 
Give me a sec. I'll scan the target. I need your help. Garudine, that's fine. Alright. I want to make Mitsuru spend a turn getting back up, so... I'm going to switch targets momentarily. I'll use Zeodyne on Yukari. A scan going on Yukari. Tactics, Metis, assign target back to Mitsuru. And item. I'll give you a medical powder. Hopefully, you'll start using Garudine. Okay? No, you won't. Here he goes again. This could be this could be a bit awkward. Alright, who all do we have who has Addis? This, actually, at, at is here might be an option here, for at least a little bit. Let me use Diarahan on myself, just so that I don't die. And then, yeah, I'll be strong against this. Don't work, just miss. Good. Bomb of Life on Metis, I think, is the correct answer here. Tarafu. Alright. Now I actually do need a Maypatra gem. Alright. Turn order is completely out of whack, but that's okay. Vishnu, you're back up. Yep, Medea Rahan is is the correct answer. Not taking the chance. You need arrows, that's fine. Let's go. Didn't even hit that hard. Let me just 
just go ahead and mine charge myself now that I have the opportunity to do so. Magarudine. Alright. Mabufudine. This could alright, this could be just a wombo combo. Yep. Item. See if a revival beat is enough here. Alright, you're doing mind charge. That's okay. I will switch back to Atis just for because I only need regular Dirahan, not Medirahan. Just go right back to Vishnu. Are you okay? Please be more careful. I'm fine, Fuka. I got Medea Rahan. Mind charge, so let's hit it with Zeodyne. I barely even feel a thing. No, nah, I know you felt that last one, Yukari. But I appreciate the sentiment all the same. I appreciate the sentiment. Kaja on yourself, okay. Persona. I'll use Medea Rahan just in case. Already in effect. All right. This may be enough. There we go. <sighs> I still don't like getting experience for this. But here we are. It's all over. Take mine too, I guess. I agree with you the most, so. The 
This is the true key. And thankfully, before any of those flames could fully burn burn down. Everyone. So we got it done fast enough. It may sound strange to hear, but I'm so glad that you're all safe. Shouldn't sound strange. So, what are you gonna do with that key? Yukari, we just had it out. Like, 20 seconds ago. That was a nice speech back there, but you still haven't made a real decision, huh? Then give it to me! <laughs> give me that key! Yukari-chan! It's no use. Only my sister can use the true key now. I know. I made a promise to him, too. I promised that I'd try my best to change this world so that people would stop wishing for the fall. It wasn't like yours. It was something I promised myself while holding his cold hand. If you notice, I'm kind of quiet in these moments because what, what more is there to say? What is there even to say? More or otherwise. That's why I decided to put the past behind me and look forward. And it's not quite that simple now, is it? Yukari son. I can't. I can't be that person. I want to see him. I don't care about anything else. I just want to see him again. Trade all of your tomorrows for just one yesterday. Yukari son. Yeah, for those who don't like the story of the answer, I challenge you with these scenes for right here at here. Just because in my opinion the story of the answer is good. The fact that it's all dungeon grinding is not. Yukari. There's no way to truly put the past behind you. In the end, you only succeed in running from it. It's painful to face, but if you don't, your wounds will never heal. So if I keep facing it, someday everything will be okay? Not necessarily okay, but you learn to live with it. It just becomes one more scar. Just a, It's just something that makes you who you are. Eventually I'll forget all about him or stop caring. No and no. You won't forget, you won't stop caring. But the pain will come, the pain will stop and you'll just, and you'll come to remember, the, you'll, the good memories will come back to, to the, back to, the, back to the forefront, not, not the bad ones. Like that's ever gonna happen. 
It take. It truly does just take time. Well, I, I won't say just take time, but... Because that's not entirely accurate either. No one knows that better than us. It's... Again, that's not what moving forward means, Yukari. You're right. But can't we be there for you when things are at their worst? Thank you, Mitsuru. Thank you. The way you were there for me last year. Huh? Many hands make light work. That may not have been what you meant at the time. But even now, I consider your being at my side last year as one of the most cherished moments of my life. That's why, when we lost him without being able to thank him, I swore deep down. If something ever happened to make you suffer, I'd put my own feelings aside and stand with you. Yep, and that's why, even when I didn't know the story of the answer ahead of time, Mitsuru siding with Yukari did not surprise me. Mitsuru Senpai? Yukari, to lose someone you had such a strong bond with is agony, but there's no need to suffer alone. You have us with you. Isn't that the whole point of forming such bonds? <laughs> I think this may be Yukari's first opportunity to truly begin to process her grief. She's spent an entire month just basically distracting herself you know, making sure that she's busy doing something else, anything else. Just to... Not, just to try to not deal with this because this was worse, because this was worse. So... I understand your feelings. But now she doesn't have a choice. She has to confront that grief. She has to... She has to begin to process, so... But as, it, as such as it always is, mourning is never the same for different people. Ever since I was born, I have spent all my time thinking about him. So, I suggest we see it, to find out once and for all, what he left for us. We still don't know the real reason behind his death. Without knowing that reason, I can't decide what is right. That's why I would like to see the past again before using this key. To see the truth of what happened the moment he used his power. Huh? Can we really do that? Can you think of a reason why not? I don't see why not. We've already experienced the past here many times. You mean those doors that lead to the past? But they all disappeared. There aren't any left. That's not true.
The only way back to the past is the door to his womb. And we know we don't want to use the key on that. No. There's one more door. Indeed. That's right. The door that leads to Polonia Mall. The doors reflect the minds of those who enter them. If our wish is strong enough, we should be able to use that door to look into the past. I see. Good thinking. How about it, everyone? Sounds like it's worth a try. What's wrong? I was just thinking, there's nothing left for me to do. And I'm sure none of you would want me along. I did some horrible things to you. Dude, what are you talking about? We all got ourselves into this mess. You don't have to be so hard on yourself. Don't you remember? I told you that I wouldn't leave you behind. <gasps> Jeez, if you'd been like that from the start, things would have been a lot smoother. <laughs> you don't say, Akihiko. You don't say. Still, we're pretty lucky there's one door left. Not sure luck has... a real lifesaver, huh? Not sure luck has anything to do with it, Ken. Now that you mention it, that is strange. Once a door's purpose has been fulfilled, it disappears. If that door's purpose is to prepare for battle, it should have vanished once the battles were over. Our fight afterward was just bickering between ourselves. There's only one logical conclusion. If that door's role is to allow us to prepare for battle, and it hasn't yet disappeared, doesn't it follow that there's still an enemy left to defeat? That it does? Our feelings are the reason for all of this. And what Igis proposed relates directly to the core of our pain. We should probably expect to encounter something unknown. Then... What now? Uh, should we find another plan? Nope, I think that's the one plan we got. What Mitsuru Senpai says is true. We have to go. Right? Let's go. Oh, okay. That's going, like, straight for it, huh? All right. Um. This. What is this? Okay, that is this ominous. Was never here before. I see the ordeal awaiting us was no mere speculation. We should come back here once we've prepared for battle. Okay, good. Give me a chance to prep. I was like, uh We're just going straight for it. <laughs> Fine with me. No matter what the truth is, we'll finally get to see it with our own eyes.
right, so, uh, yeah, we got, uh... Yeah, this is gonna be tough, so let's just... I'm curious. Yeah, Elizabeth, so it has. So it seems to have. The end? Beelzebub gives me Thanatos. Growth 2, Growth 3, oh my god. Um, so I'm going to save, because I think I know what I want to do. But I'm going to need some more experience to do it. And I'm going to need a persona that, uh... I haven't seen it in a while. So... I'm gonna save, and I think I'll call it an evening. Because, uh... We've come a long way, and despite the way it sounds, these cracks don't actually spread, so you're not actually constrained by anything. Um, as always, thank you so much for, uh, for watching, uh, and, uh, I will see you all in the next part. Have a good one.